Hello everyone, welcome to the itvideos.com. In this video, I'm going to talk about how we can add the page layout to the MVC application. Page layout actually allows users to have consistency across the website. So if you have got, let's say, 10 plus pages and if you all like to have the same look and feel across the website, so you can just make use of the page layout. So as you can see on my Solution Explorer, I do not have a page layout. So if I just uh, go and uh, run this page, see this is just displaying the blank hello world from MVC, which is actually this one. This is the default of the home. This is the default method of the home controller. So let's just explain that. Now I have a view here. So if I were to go ahead and do that, if I were to just type home, hello view, it just displays the content from the hello view. It says hello from view in MVC application, which is this one right here. Now, let's go ahead and create uh, let's go ahead and create a layout i'm going to minimize this one and i'm going to go inside the view i'm going to add a shared folder i'm going to add a folder and i'm going to name that as shared and inside of the shared folder I'm going to create a page layout. So I'm going to say new item. MVC for layout page. I'm just going to say playout page. I'm going to click on add. And here we are. So if you look at the uh, code that MVC has added for us. This is the title of the site. This could this is going to be the title of the site that will be displayed and some meta tags and the body has one special code here that says render body. Render body actually displays the information from the child pages that we have. So this is acting as a master page and inside of the master page we have all the child pages. So now in the body of this i can add anything that i want i can add the menu i can add the header of the page so to speak so i have a code here with me i'm just going to include that which is right here so here as you can see, I've added some JavaScript references and here I have the header on the page. I have some menus and the name of the website. So if I save this one, now we have our page layout created. Now if I go and build the solution, and if I say start without debugging, it, if I go back and go back to the same page, it still does not display anything that we have added. Why? Because we have not added any reference to the page layout. So to do that, I'm going to go to the view. I'm going to go straight to the top. This indicates that this is the razor code. I'm going to say layout equals the path of my page layout. And now this razor view has a reference to the page layout. I'm going to save this and build the solution and say start with the debugging and it's 
go back to the page refresh it it now displays the content from our page layout which is the master page so this is coming from the master page which will be available across the site and this is the content coming from the reserve view page so that's how we add the page layout in my next video I'm going to show you how you can add styles to the page layout so thanks for watching join me in the next video thank you